you guys welcome back to my channel so for today we're gonna do another unboxing this just came to the mail today so I'm excited to unbox um, this one with you you know that I'm always excited doing an unboxing with you guys I like to share a base special moment of unboxing with you so for those who are new to my channel hi um, I my channel is basically consists of unboxing unboxing luxury items sourcing reviews and other fun stuff so let's go ahead and do the unboxing together so I've waited like five days for this to arrive in the mail I did not really anticipate that it's gonna take that long <laughs> But since when I contacted my SA, she said that they don't have it at stock um, on their particular, th this particular item on the store. So I just told her to go ahead and I'll just probably wait for five days. Alright, I am super excited to see what's inside. Well, actually, I already know what's inside. So, ta-da! It's a Prada item. And it's beautifully um, packed with, well, I'm assuming there's no box for this one, which I'm hoping that there was a box. I'm a very um, big when it comes to box, but probably just text my essay for that for my next purchase if see if she can include a box for this item especially okay so maybe some of you already have an idea of what is this what item that I bought okay so in this comes with this cute Prada. I believe this is my receipt. So I'll put that one on the side here. All right, so that's all that came with and this beautiful cotton um, dust bag. And there she is. Got the it bag in nude color. I was actually debating whether to get the black one or the nude one for this um, Prada 2005 leather Sepiano bag. Um, but this is so beautiful. The letter is very, you know, um, I am more onto, I'm more onto like leather types of bags compared to like nylon. Just one, um, versatility, um, I, I feel like it will last longer, especially if nylon gets wet. It's harder for you to get rid of the stain. But in leather-wise, it's easier for you to clean. Of course, it's a little bit more expensive than the nylon one. But yeah, so it comes with this chain, gold chain. And let's see what's inside. Okay. So this is the care card, I'm assuming. There's another one in here. And I believe so. This is my authenticity card. Looks like this. And the date that I purchase it and where I purchase it. And this is how it looks inside. And another, oops. And another dust bag. It comes with this cute. Um, it's this is almost similar to 
a um, the Louis Vuitton multi brochette, which is actually I have as well. If you guys want me to do a comparison between the two, just let me know. Um, you can comment down on the section box below and I will do a comparison what fits and which one I think um, is better. All right, so this is the strap and it only has the one side that says Prada. I wish Prada actually did like put all over like Prada logo in here. It would be so much nicer, but it's only in the outside. So I will go ahead and hook this one here. And on the strap, I think, I don't know if you guys can see it. I'll bring it closer. It says Prada on that side. And okay. And also there you go. So this is adjustable. You can wear it two different ways if you just want it to be you know a shoulder bag or you want it in casual chic days where you can just wear it like crossbody or you can even wear it like an evening type of like um it's easier to close um close and open but i have to see what really um what will fit in here and this one right here that says Prada Re Edition. For everyone that is wondering, um, sometimes you get lucky if you check in the website and it's available, but it's sold out super fast. So when one out when I was looking at the website, it says available, and I was contemplating whether to get the black one or the nude one. So when the next day I decided um, both of them are already sold out. So I texted my essay and as you can tell from the receipt, it's from Neiman Marcus. So it's easier for you to actually get something what you want, especially having an SA from Neiman Marcus or Saks Fifth Avenue, whichever you have. It's easier for you to actually um, get an item. One, because there are multiple stores and they can actually check their um, different size of location if they have it. And it's easier. All you have to do is let your essay know pay for it and then they'll take care of it so this is retail for nine, $19.90 so $1,990 US dollars plus tax I paid $2,000 let me double check here I paid $2,095 for this bag and the question is if I'm gonna keep it, of course I'm gonna keep it. This is something that I would like to keep. Um, I think I would have for a very long time. And this is my first Prada bag. So definitely I will keep this one. So you, if you guys have any comments or thoughts about this bag you guys let me know i would definitely love to interact with you guys and yeah i'll see you guys next time bye